Hey everybody, it's High Tech Man here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to reformat or reprogram or reinstall Mountain Lion on your MacBook Pro. And what I've done already is I've already made myself a USB flash drive with a Mountain Lion on it. And if you didn't catch my last video on how to do that, you can just go ahead and click the flash drive. And it'll take you straight to the last video of me making this USB flash drive. But my, my computer's been giving me some problems, so I decided I'm just going to reinstall Mountain Lion. So we're just going to delve straight into the project, and here we go. Okay, so once you have your computer 100% turned off, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to put your flash drive into the computer. So just go ahead and do that real quickly here. And then you're going to also want to hold down the Alt Option key and turn on your computer. So just hold the Alt Option key until the computer boots up. Once the computer 100% uh, boots up into disk mode, all you can do is just double click on the Mac OS X recovery. And then it'll bring you to the Mountain Lion recovery. So just give it a few seconds here. Okay, so now you're going to see the OSX utilities. Now what you want to do is you want to start off by using disk utility and click continue. Because what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to wipe everything on your hard drive because you want this to be a clean install of uh, Mountain Lion. So you're just going to want to go ahead and select your hard drive. The, in my case it's going to be the 250 gigabyte Hitachi hard drive. And you're going to want to select the tab here that says erase. After that, it's going to ask you what format. Just leave it the Mac OS, at the OS extended journal. And in this case, we're going to call it the same thing I had it last time, which is uh, Macintosh uh, HD for hard drive. And then hit Erase. It's going to say, are you sure? Erase. It's going to unmount the disk. It's going to create a partition table and just quickly do a quick format. And then after that, it'll be done. So now, well, now we're done with disk utility. Now you can just exit out of disk utility. And then now you want to install OS X. In this case, it's just going to say reinstall. So just go ahead and select the reinstall OS X. Click continue, and then it's going to say welcome to Mountain Lions, just click continue. It's going to be your uh, legal disclaimer here, just go ahead and make sure that you read through that and hit agree. And you agree to the terms and conditions. And then now it's going to sell, say where do you want to install it. So you just select your normal hard drive, the one that we just got through formatting. After you've selected it, just hit install. And then now it's going to prepare to install and it will automatically restart the computer. So I'm just going to go ahead and fast forward this part of the video. Okay, now your computer's going to reboot. It shouldn't be that long. It's just going to go ahead and do its normal paces. Okay, so now it's going through the actual installation process. This is the part where it'll actually start installing the operating system. So it'll take roughly about, depending on how fast your computer is, anywhere from 20 to 40 minutes. So I'm just going to go ahead and fast forward this part of the video. Okay, once the installation is successful, you'll be able to see this window here. Just go ahead and click restart. And then now after your computer 100% reboots, you should have Mountain Lion on your computer again. So now all you have to do is just set up your computer like as if it was the first time you set up your computer. These settings are re relatively easy to do. Just go through, keep, click continue, put your name, credentials, and everything. And that's pretty much how you reprogram or reinstall Mountain Lion on your Macintosh computer. Again, this has been High Tech Man, signing off.